perhaps improve the way readers navigate our page. And by organising and segmenting content, we make it easier for readers to find and prioritise the information they need. So starting in edit mode, you'll find the tab macro from the quick insert menu by searching forward slash tabs. In the editor, we'll create a tab group. To do this, select start new tab group. You'll only need to select this once per tab group. From here onwards, additional tab macros that you add to your page will automatically be added to this group. That is until you break the sequence by selecting this checkbox to start a new group. Moving on, I'll keep the default tab group direction as horizontal and I'll give the tab a title. Add some color if you'd like to and select save. Now, if you're looking to create an individual or a standalone tab, then that's it. Otherwise, repeat the same steps to add additional tabs to the tab group. This time in the editor, just update the tabs title field and select save. Finalize tab setup with some content and publish to see the tab macro in action. To learn more, see our documentation or start a free trial from the Atlassian Marketplace using the link in the description.